kids well welcome back and i hope you had a wonderful spring break enjoyed the time off stepped away from the screens for a little bit got out and enjoyed the sunshine and are just feeling a little bit rejuvenated now before spring break we were talking about the treble clef pitches shared with you the story of igbedef the musical yak and that the line notes have a special order from lowest to highest goes E, G, B, D, and F. Then the next week we filled in the spaces. And the spaces kind of easier to remember because space rhymes with face because it fills in F, A, C, and E. Just to remind ourselves here, because the musical staff has five lines, just like that, our line notes would be E, G, B, D, and F. It doesn't matter what order. What matters is which number line the note is on. Then in between, we'd have F, A, C, and E. And with those seven letters, A, B, C, D, E, F, and G, the seven letters of the musical alphabet, there are several words that we can spell. Well, if I were you, I would get a scrap piece of paper, a napkin, paper towel, piece of paper, but something that you can write on as a reference. Because I want you to draw yourself a staff. So we'll, let's walk through it together. And actually, I had a thought. I'll be right back. I like when things are color coded and if color coding helps your brain organize it like mine does pause find yourself two different colors that you can write with so for our staff we have five lines one two three four and five just like that now because we are in the treble class we, we want to use a treble clef at the beginning. I make mine as a line, just like that. Then a capital D, and kind of a swoopy, whoop, number six. So line, D, six. Go ahead and make sure that you have your treble staff drawn out. And let's fill in the letters. We've got E, G, B, D, and F. So go ahead and fill yours in as well. And if you want to use a different color, you are more than welcome to. If you want to use the same color, that's totally fine too. And I want to fill in my space notes. Oh. All right, that marker's dry. Maybe this one works. Come on. Yes. Right. So my space notes F, 
A, C, and E. Now we've got our handy dandy little reference sheet. So make sure you got this handy. So we're going to need it to figure out what's next.